5. India and the US have signed an important agreement. The Logistics Exchange Memorandum of Agreement, LEMOA, allows them to use each other's land, air and naval bases for repair and resupply. With the signing, this long contemplated logistics agreement can finally become operational. This is a major step toward reinforcing defense ties. Number 4 The strategic agreement has been finalized keeping in view the current situation, which are as follows. 1. India remains on hostile terms with China, from border disputes dating back to war in the 1960s. US and China has also been in loggerhead on many aspects including continuing hostilities in South China Sea dispute. To know more about what China is doing in South China Sea, please watch the video on above card. This move is specifically designed to counter an aggressive China. Pakistan, it must not be forgotten, is making itself a base for Beijing's forces to operate in its region. In recent past China and Pakistan has taken many steps which are detrimental to India's interest. Some example are, supporting terrorists against India, blocking India's membership into NSG, and developing CPEC through Pakistan-occupied Kashmir. 2. It is also a matter of dealing with the common enemy of the US and India, that is radical jihadists. For example, ISIS recently carried out a terror bombing in Bangladesh and may try to spread its wings in Asia. The bases will enable US and India to carry out operations against these elements, if required. Number 3 There have been many misinformation being floated in mainstream media. Unlike perceived, one important aspect of the deal is that there will be no permanent basis, but will be used on case-to-case -case basis. Also, both countries made it clear that the logistics agreement did not allow the basing of US troops in India. Apart from that, the agreement also underlines the fact that the US can't use Indian base for operations against India's friendly nation, and vice versa. Number 2 Lemoa simplifies logistic sharing. Here are the advantages. The US Navy plans to deploy 60% of its surface ships in the Indo-Pacific in the near future. Instead of having to build facilities virtually from the ground up, as in Afghanistan and Iraq, the US now has the benefit of using the tremendous Indian facilities. US have large number of bases around the world and this will be strategically very helpful for India. Here is an example to understand it better. Think of a situation where a US vessel needs fuel and supplies from their Indian counterparts. Instead of having to pay in cash for them, India will simply maintain a ledger balance for the transactions, which is cleared in one go at the end of the fiscal year. Similarly, if an Indian naval vessel suffers a maintenance problem while visiting the US for an exercise, the repairs are done at an American port. Number 1 The United States already recognizes India as a major defense partner, helped to join the missile technology control regime and is willing to provide licenses for top US defense technology. USA has also lobbied hard for India's NSG bid. India's Defense Minister Mr. Parikar's last visit to Washington, marks his sixth interaction with US Defense Secretary Ash Carter. Mr. Carter has made closer military ties with India a priority, and also established a special unit last year within the Pentagon for this. The US and India are also finalizing two foundational agreements, the Communications Interoperability and Security Memorandum of Agreement CISMOA, and Basic Exchange and Cooperation Agreement for Geospatial Cooperation BECA. LEMOA is a big step forward in Indo-US relationship and will go a long way in further strengthening of Indo-US ties. For both the US and India, LEMOA is a powerful response to China's aggressive behavior. 
Thanks for watching. Indian Space Research Organization (ISRO) has successfully tested its scramjet engine with Mach 6 speed. Watch this video to know more.